Hello everyone, and welcome back to Stephen and Mal play Donkey Kong Country 3. On the last episode, we ventured into the fourth world, Mechanos. We uh, also finished Demolition Drain Pipe, which was probably one of the most enjoyable levels in the game, although it is not the only sled level, or cart Ooh. level if you want to call it. Uh, there are more cart levels that will be coming up. This is just one of several. Now we're going to be making our way into the forest, and I do mean forest, Ripsaw Rage. <sighs> you can I, do it. This is... This scared me as a kid. You'll probably see why. Oh god, I hate this level. You're in a wooded level. Tree. You're in a tree. A wooded tree. <laughs> You're in another wooded level, just like you were uh, often in World 2. But this time there's a giant saw blade chasing your monkey behind. And you gotta be careful because you, you have to go as fast as you can. And a lot of times you can't even see the jumps you're trying to make because you're, you're, you want to be as far ahead of the uh, blade as you can. And there's the stupid rats. And the, and the rats screw everything up because you're trying to hurry. But if you hurry too much, then you won't even be able to see the stupid rats. First bonus level's right here. Nailed it. Now, I've had some, I've had some serious trouble with this one in practice. And the, the sad thing is, if you mess this up, there is actually a split second that you can, I think, get back into it, but it's uh, it's difficult. Oh god! Oh god! <laughs> oh Jesus! I got, it, I got it! I got it! I got it! Whoa! Holy crap! Screw that, man! Screw that! <laughs> oh, okay. So now I'm here. Hi, B. Okay, we're not doing the B. Now the focus is to. Where am I going? Success! Holy! Oh god! Go get. Quick. I know! I'm just freaking out a little bit. Now the goal is to successfully make it to the halfway barrel, which is right there. Hallelujah. Okay, so at least we have that going for us. Um, now, we just need to focus on getting into the next area. And the next area is a piece of crap. Uh, you have to actually know ahead of time that it's coming up. Because if you don't, you will not be moving fast enough to get the barrel necessary to do it. And that's all going to make sense in a second. <laughs> Where is it? It's You're not there yet. I know, but it's real close. It's somewhere up here. I'm just trying to continue it. It's we're how where is it? It's like You're okay. You're not there yet. I know, but we're we're close. No, you're not that close. No, that's not it. This is it. It's the Oh god. Well, good timing, I guess. Make sure you jump up. Th take your time. Jump up there. Grab me. We're good. Yep, this it's is it. We come to the no, left. This tree. is it. This is it. Run as fast as you can because this is the barrel. Grab the barrel. Jump! You dropped the barrel. Run through the bee. You have invincibility. It's not gonna matter. We needed the barrel to get the coin. No, this is the bee. This is the second bonus level. What? Yes, go run at the bee. Are you sure? Yes. Oh! Oh, where am I going? Yes! Good job, Mal. I thought that, that was the thing we needed for no, coin. No, we're looking for the lone banana for coin. Holy crap, good thinking with the <laughs> running through the bee thing. Okay, grab 15 bananas. Also, this one sucks because you're being moved around by but the salt But you have blade. invincibility. I know, but it's still hard. Although, every time we've practiced this one, we have beat it. Oh, God! Ugh. So, I'm assuming that we'll do fine. I just gotta get them as fast as I can. Oh, God! You're oh, okay. Jiminy Christmas! One more. There you go. Oh, wow. I've actually never done it that fast. Oh, I guess everything Good is job. okay. Now I hate this level. The lone banana. I hate this level. Lone banana. Alright. As long as I can continue to avoid the enemies and maybe get another That's DK That's the lone barrel. banana there on the right. Got it. Whoop! So now we just fall into this thing. And this is going to shoot us you up into the air. We're currently invincible, so now we just got to ride the rails. Now you need that metal barrel. I'm going to grab this. Come through here. Stand here, throw, and kill. Got it, baby. That was absurd. I hate that level. Oh you my were god! Panicking with that second metal. I barrel. was having flashbacks to my <laughs> childhood right there. And and actually, fun fact, I, I this is the world that I got stuck on when I was a very young kid. Um, when whenever the game like first came out and I, I had played it, I'm pretty sure this is the world I got stuck on. And I don't even know if I beat Ripsaw Rage. Anyway, I'm feeling better. Mal, Ready for this one? Mal, take us to Blazing Bazookas. Another corporate level, another uh, mechanical level or whatever. Mal, Mal, I was going to say, Mal's almost dying there. 
Uh, those guys are the bazookas. Um, you can't kill them unless you have a uh, TNT barrel. But uh, they continually shoot barrels. If they're wooden barrels, you can actually hop on top of them, which you're going to have to do at some point in the level. Um, some of them shoot TNT barrels, though, which you obviously can't destroy. So now it's going to demonstrate, there we go, how we can uh, use that to Whee! cross the gap. And here's a friend shooting TNT barrels. Obviously, we can't get hit by those, so we have to uh, avoid them as best we can. And here's some more. Oh, oh wow. How did you even so do that? That was so close. You, like, oh my bounced God. off of his lip. All right, now here is very, very difficult part, and you actually have to uh, successfully do this or you can't get to one of the bonus levels. Mal's going to have to grab this TNT barrel, and then she's going to make her way down there, jumping over every TNT barrel she can until she finds the bazooka and kills it with the TNT barrel. And this it's hard because I hold it in front of me. Careful. Ah! And that's that. There will never be another TNT barrel, so it's actually impossible to get this bonus level this run through. So we'll actually have to finish it up and come back. What the heck? Oh my god. <laughs> what the heck? Are you kidding me? <laughs> Are you kidding me? I didn't know you could do that. I didn't try to. Okay, that's what we were trying to do, everyone. We were trying to... Um, to kill the bazooka so we could get to the squitter barrel behind him, but Mao has managed to somehow do it without that. Um, okay. Alright, so uh, where we're going now is up. <laughs> uh, Mao's in control, she's going to lead us up in the air. Um, and Mao, <laughs> Mao doesn't have as much experience with squitters as Squitter I do. Squitter makes me really nervous. Um, you have to be very careful here. You have to get up, you have to get... Okay, wait for it. Now jump and start shooting with Y. There you go. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep shooting. Don't stop shooting. Don't stop shooting in the jump. And now this part is actually a pretty difficult one. You got it? No. <laughs> you, you can do it. You can do it. This is... I actually did this one in practice. You have to keep moving forward, though. You, you have to... You're going to have to push him further than that, Mal. Just don't fall off in the middle of nowhere. There you go. There you go. There you go. Shoot that one down. Now... Shoot it down. Mal, you got to jump. Oh. And you were so close, too. Where does it drop me off? Uh, you're going to have to go back. And that guy's still... There's another transformation barrel. Um, you're going to have to go all the way back. You have to make sure you don't get shot. You can you can s tell by the way that Mal plays his squitters that it freaks her out. Um, hey, hey, another TNT barrel. Wow. So it will respawn if you go to a bonus level. That's interesting. Although, we wouldn't have gotten to that bonus level anyway, so it's actually a really weird coincidence. Oh my god. Well, well I'm in control. It. Why am I not shooting? Now you're shooting. I'm shooting now. There we go. There we go. Keep it up. Jump! Alright, now I'm the one <sighs> giving this uh, bonus level a shot. Let's good. see if I can do it. Yeah, <laughs> mouse is good. Of course, now I'll probably fail. Look at me go. Are you kidding me? I gotta make up for some extreme lost time here. Got it. I did that with like five webs. Oh my god. Oh, I'm just <laughs> glad I did it, to be honest. That was that was nuts. Okay. Um, Left. But we have squitters right now, which is good. Uh, what I'm going to do is not take that thing and go this way, because this is where coin is. Now, coin is continually being shot by a bazooka on the left side of the area, but he is shooting him. I actually need one a little lower. He is shooting him with plain barrels, which do not kill coin. Only metal barrels do. Luckily, there is an app for that. Okay, hold on. We'll do this. Dang it. Alright, shoot your metal barrel. Shoot your metal barrel. There we go. There we go. Got it. Woo! That was close. God, I hate that. Alright, we go. should be able to take the... Uh, the express train here. I'm gonna go ahead and hit this thing. And on the other side is a DK barrel, which I'm gonna go ahead and grab. Is there anything over here we actually need? Or is this the way we this go? This is the way you go. Are you sure? What's to the left? Um, I don't remember. Mm, nothing really. Just oh, that. What is why is this important? <laughs> Just to get right. That's all it is. 
Okay, I'm gonna turn that into standard barrels, so he's shooting standard barrels. And then I'm going to go over here. Do I need to, like, go no, up here? you just here? need to go... I just need to fall down? Well, you can... No, go right. You're fine. Just keep moving right. You're going above his head. Okay. I'm skipping this dude. Yeah. Oh, that's right. I think that's only important if you don't have squithers. Mm -hmm. Like, if you didn't manage to get squithers, that would be a big deal to you. But if not, it doesn't matter. Okay. Back to more bullcrap. That's exciting. Yeah. Yeah. Jesus. You can do it. No, I got it. Basic platforming 101. I'm good. Where are we going? Left. Hi, buddy. How are you? Oh, good. Now I get to decide when I want to end my life. And go time. Oh, woo. I was actually moving a little too fast. <laughs> more of those clap traps. There yep. they are. Gotcha. Alright. Now we're going up. And, uh, more TNT goodness. Moving down. Woo! I think I can fall here. Yep. There's a backup DK barrel. Which I almost you needed. You may need. Okay. Now this is uh, actually where we're going to go to the other bonus level once we get to the very top. Whoop! And another one. This guy's uh, shooting up the standard barrels. But still don't want to get hit by those. Now, as Dixie, I have access to the loud... Oh, God. Oh, oh, oh God. Jump right. I, I'm trying. You can't jump right when you're focused on jumping over the <laughs> hurdles. I'm focused on the not dying. All right. This sucks. I hate this one so much. Oh, God. Dang it. It's a lot harder than it looks. Oh, God! Don't die, don't ah. die, don't die. <laughs> I was dancing in front of the bazooka. <laughs> don't shoot me! Oh, God, that was not... I'm good, I'm good. You just gotta make it to the end. Okay, I think I just fall down yes. here. Okay. Probably more clap traps. Of course, there's one. And another. And now for the finale. Ready, set, move it. Yeah. All right, now this is the really, really ridiculous one because this barrel actually shoots you above the rope, so you have to take that into consideration when you shoot out of the barrel. And it totally blows, and I hate it. Oh, God. Got it. I'm good. Woo! Congratulations. Thank you so much. That level sucks. That level totally sucks. All right. <laughs> now it's going to take us to Logi Labyrinth. It's uh, really not that much of a labyrinth. It's a really, really Whee! cool level. Um, you could probably already tell, but they've uh, we've got low gravity going on. That's what the G stands it's for. It's fun. It is fun. And uh, I actually, I don't remember getting here as a, as a little kid. Um, Hi. You gotta be careful with them jumps. I know. This level's hard. Uh, because you have to make sure all of your... <laughs> I doubted myself there for a second. All of your jumps are good. There are some banana strands which kind of help you in determining, you know, if it's a good jump or not. Oh, where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Come... Gotcha. <laughs> Ooh, once they're dead, they won't reappear. Having Dixie in this area is uh, really, really nice because any time during your jump, you can activate your helicopter spin. Although once you've activated it and let go, you can't reactivate it. It's just bananas Those that are way. Those just bananas. So I'm gonna jump over you. Excuse me. Jump down here. Okay. This. Oh God. This is not anywhere close to my favorite level because. Everything you you know <laughs> changes. There we go. See, that's so helpful having the uh, the helicopter spin there. This is definitely a Dixie level, if only for the fact that you can save yourself occasionally. <laughs> okay, careful, careful. That green toxic gas can't be good for you. Well, I just presume that it's not toxic and is instead what is making you jump so high. Now, above those guys is uh, the bonus first barrel. bonus level, but it's really hard to get to. Um, in fact, I don't think you can get to it without two people, and I guess you could team jump to it, but screw that. Um, instead, I like to become Squawks, 
purple squawks. Purple squawks. The difference between purple and green is that uh, green can shoot eggs out of his mouth, purple cannot. And then I just come back and do it this way. A little bit easier, I feel. Collect 80 stars. I got these things. We didn't really have a, a whole lot of trouble with this level in practice. Not, I mean, there was a... It feels like you're really tight on time, though. On this? Yeah. Air, this right here? I was talking about the entire level, oh. like the low-G labyrinth. At the beginning, we did, because you have to get used to the changes. But otherwise, it's, it's not too bad. And now we're actually going to play a majority of the rest of the level as Squawks, which I prefer, because I feel like I have much more... finesse. <laughs> I'm a chew on your face. Mmm... Alright, so let's get up here. Bam! There's an extra one. This Squawks is also unique because he can carry barrels. So I can actually hold barrels with my talons. So I can actually drop it on this guy. Boom! But then I don't get an extra barrel, so <laughs> I have to be very careful as I fall down here. Ooh. Yeah! Alright. Extra barrel. And I'm gonna try and coax just this one guy. There we go. So I can fit down here. Woo! Hi guys, how's it going? I'm just uh just chilling this purple squawks. <laughs> Alright, this part sucks. Up. Squeeze back through. And the end. Shoot, 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 shoot. Good. We're good. We're good. Alright. Now, down here is the second bonus level. It is possible to fit through there without using a barrel, but there is a TNT barrel above. The hardest part I've had in practice is trying to get it out, uh, through... Not killing that bee. Yeah, without using it on this bee. So... Oh, God. I'm gonna try. Go! There we go. Alright, so let's drop this right on this guy's head. Kaboom! <laughs> Killed by the power of, of Billy... Well, I was gonna say Billy Maze. Because you get... Cause yeah, the kaboom, I, I yeah. got it. Did you get... Okay. Yeah. Now you're green squawks. <laughs> Oh, thank God. All right, this one's pretty straightforward. We just have to uh, fly through and kill the enemies. Gotcha. Boom. It's egg time. And the gravity action... eggs. It's, it's hard probably to, uh, to show on camera or on the recording, but Squawks is also affected by the gravity, and it's really hard to control him because otherwise he controls really well. But uh, in, the, in the low gravity level... I mean, it's like you're holding down, and he would normally, like, shoot down as fast as he could, and he doesn't really do that. Alright, so let's carefully squeeze through here. I was kind of close. And I'm gonna take this with me. I don't remember why. Oh, there's a bee. If I wanted that You can. Thing. You don't need it otherwise, I don't think. Oh, yeah. Actually, I'm not gonna get any other use out of it, so I might as well use it to kill this guy. Boom! In the face! 60 lives! That's a pretty good number. Alright, this is gonna shoot us up here. And, uh, we don't go right because this level actually had multiple branching paths, and, uh, if we hadn't went to the bonus level, this is the way we would have come out. So now we're just gonna make our way up here, and that way will take you... I think both ways will take you to the end of the level, but this way is not the way to get coin. If you want coin, you actually have to go to the left. So we're gonna try it. Hit... <laughs> I'm like booty dancing in front of this guy. You want some of this? Mmm, sugar. Mmm, you want some of this? I got... I, I slowly got closer to him, though. You were real close to him. Oh, God. Nyeh. Jafar. Oh, God! Piss. All right, mouse and control. All right, this, is, this isn't this is too bad, though. Um, all she's got to do is die. And then she's going to use Kitty to grab that thing, and she can take her time, she can jump over there, she can actually just stand on top of it and kill him. Done. So, the good news is, even if somehow Mal dies, we do have the DK coin. We do have, uh, both, um, bonus levels. So we have completed that. Mal's going to go this way, she's going to roll that, and then run as fast as she can. Did it kill- oh my god, it didn't kill the other bees. Yeah, I knew that was going to happen. I knew happen you shouldn't have done it. You shouldn't have done it. You don't even have to go this way. <sighs> okay, so now Mao is uh, just going to take the barrel that she got from Squawks and head right. The advantage to going left, there is an advantage, and I understand why Mao was heading that way. If you go all the way left, there's an invincibility barrel, 
and then you can use that invincibility. <laughs> he tried to kill that one. You can use the invincibility barrel to run through some of the green bees, and I guess you could, yeah, you could kill the uh, the red ones as well, or at least bounce off of them or something. Um, I did it. Although I don't think it's possible to actually get all the way up here with the invincibility barrel. That's I the don't think thing. so. It doesn't last all that long. All right, and uh, with that. We are going to move on to the very last level. Uh, we've taken out all of the uh, the levels in this world. Uh, the only thing left is the boss, and that's going to put us uh, through to the fifth world. But first, we have to beat Chaos Carnage. You ready? Yes. This one's not that hard, to be honest. It's, no, it's, it's not bad it's, at all. It's really not bad, although by saying that, I'll probably lose. So this big old robot comes down to... Bzz, click, gongs, enemy. You must be... Destroyed. Alright, uh, basically he's just a big old guy that occasionally comes down to the ground, and uh, if you're anywhere near the ground when the afterburner hits, then you'll die. Then these saw blades come out, and you have to jump on his head. Bob him on the head. Six times and you win. Well, yeah. <laughs> uh, after the third time, it does change up a little bit, but it's really not, it's really not all that bad. That's two of six. Beep. With Dixie, it's it's real easy. We just stick in the corner and uh, wait it out. Okay. Give me them blades, baby. Boom! All right, so after the third time, his head pops off. Helmet. That's his head over there. And that happens every freaking time. He pushes you up against the wall after that, and then it, it it's harder. Yeah, I knew that was going to happen, because I can't spin jump. And she can't spin jump, so she just... You just get to roast. Yeah. You just get to roast. Crispy Krong. Krong. <laughs> what was Crispy that? Kong. Crispy Kong? That's demented and terrible. You should feel awful. Technically, you should be on fire right now. My poor little feety pajamas. Okay, let's give this uh, another shot, see if we can actually do it this time. Come here, little chaos carnage. Nope! See, he squishes you when it once he's done the transformation. That's what sucks. Gotcha. We also didn't give him a chance to show the um, uh, the punching gloves, boxing gloves that come out. But there are boxing gloves that come out and try to to punch you, knock you off the blades. Yeah, knock you off the blades. Bleep. Once he once he transforms, I'm gonna be very careful to like get out of the corner because I don't want to. I don't want the same thing to happen to me again. Boom! All right. So now the head pops off, and I'm hoping that he won't squish me. Nope. Oh, there we go. I think I got him this time. Dang it! I told myself I wouldn't do that, and then I did it. All right, up to Mal. Ah. Okay, Mal fell off. Mal's. What? What? What were you doing? I wasn't you... thinking. Sorry. <laughs> Oh, okay. All right. I'm okay. You're okay. You're okay. You have not lost. I load. Woo, that was close. All right. There you go. There you go. Okay. Not this time because he's going to punch you, but then the second time. The punching doesn't actually hurt you, but it knocks you off. Okay. And Mao was unable to jump. All right. <laughs> it's okay. We're, I've got faith that Kitty can do this. Just putting my, putting my faith in Kitty. All right. Jump on the blade. Jump on the blade. You did not just... Okay, wait for the third one. And here it comes around. Here's your other chance. Jump on the blade. Jump on the blade. You did it! Perfect. All right, now the head starts shooting at you. So you just gotta, gotta take take it slow. Make sure he's not gonna not gonna get you stuck in a corner. Mouse's gonna be very careful not to get shot. All right. And then he does this bullcrap again. There you go. Okay, you missed it. And give it another shot. Dang it. It actually didn't count, which is kind of funny. Just be careful. Wait for him to shoot at you. Then there you go. Oh, ho, ho. his eyes glow. Well, also you, you got to make sure you're not going too fast because then you'll be stuck in the corner. Oh, okay. Just missed it again. It That's, knocks you off. It's yeah. Okay. You got it. You got it. Bam. All right. Now Mal only has to do this one more time, and we win. It's all on you. No pressure. Oh my God. <laughs> His eyes lit up, and I was like, you are toast. Come to Big Papa once, twice, KO! That was it, right? Yeah. That was six? Yeah, that was six. Bzz, 
Tongs win. Does not compute. Next time we meet, chaos will win. I'm like that guy from Police Academy. You do so well. Thank you. We got a ski. Uh, we got a ski on World 3. We got a ski on World 4. Now we have skis. Now we have skis. And the reason we have skis is because we get to upgrade our vehicle. So whenever we head back to Funky's Rentals, which Mal's going to gracefully do for us now, well, maybe not completely gracefully, but do for us now, we have a new option. Well, hey, you found two skis. Awesome. I've got all the parts I need to make you the ultimate ride. Wait right there, Cogs, while I get you my latest and greatest budget. Turbo Ski. Bonkers. A built-in a cool turbo feature that will be sure to take you to new heights. Just press Y. Yay. Bust a move. Got a groove. Uh, that's funny. So now we have uh, the Turbo Ski. Wait, <laughs> you can really go, can't you? Whee! It's got a lot of gas. But that is how we get up waterfalls. <laughs> that's how we get up waterfalls. There. There we go. That's how we get up waterfalls. And the next destination for uh, the next episode is K3. We'll be going to that uh, next episode. Thank you so much for watching. Join us next time for more Stephen Amell play Donkey Kong Country 3. Oh, 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 oh. <gasps> oh, God! Oh, no, no, no. Woo, 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 oh, God. Ah, ah, oh, crap, oh, crap, oh, crap. That was close. Just uh, do a little, oh, we missed it. Fart. <laughs> it would actually be easier to kill you. As Tim <laughs> as Timbaland once said, kill yourself, kill yourself. If I was you, I would, you know, never mind. <laughs>